and like after mains like we really got to know how these competitive exams like really mess up with your mind on that day those tests are just there to remind you what you are lacking in and for you to improve on those topics my hands started shaking when in the exam yeah in, in the, the exam. in the exam sanjay and his friends did something smart they divided and conquered it start the new journey in the professional process and go rule the world hello and welcome to the small felicitation program for the amazing students who performed phenomenally well in the je main and je advance exam of 2023 the children from the various diksha campuses just to quickly share some of the results uh, from diksha this year uh, in the je main exam a whopping 326 students have qualified for the je main exam of which 26 have scored over 99 percentile and as of uh, today 47 students have already got admission to nit suratkal and the 15 20 more are there who are getting admission to other nits and triple iits a wonderful performance hartiyas <laughs> hartiyas congratulations now from these 326 children 151 children prepared and studied hard and wrote the je advance examination and i'm very happy to share 51 students that is 30% of the students who wrote the je advance exam qualified and cracked the je advance exam and as of today 31 students have already secured admission to the various iits and we are hopeful in the next couple of rounds another 8 to 10 more students should be able to join and enter the iits so happy happy <laughs> round of applause happy congratulations and these children have gone to various iits mumbai kharagpur kanpur chennai indore roorkee delhi hyderabad all iits and i'm sure these children would have lots of pearls of wisdom bits of advice for their juniors who are watching this video getting ready themselves 6 months from now or a year from now when they will be writing the je main and the je advance examinations so come let's go invite the students talk to them felicitate them and hear from them i'd like to invite uh, prerna prerna r to kindly come congratulations prerna prerna scored a rank of 3559 in the je main examinations and je advance examination rank of 945 this was in the category ranks that was there a fantastic performance all excited about joining the iit prerna hearty yes. hearty congratulations yes. which which iit have you got uh, your seat in right now still in uh, first round i got uh, iit kanpur Lovely. aerospace Wonderful. so i thought of floating and going to the second round so there i got uh, triple iit darwad computer science computer science fantastic and, uh, even i have got in uh, iist sir Pure sciences. Aero, aerospace. Oh, aerospace ISC. Oh, lot of choices. Yes. Difficult call to make. Yes. What are you looking at? What are you hope, hoping to join? Uh, sir, I'm totally confused. So I'm <laughs> like I even wrote NEET exam as well. So I am waiting for uh, that counseling too. Do you want to be a doctor or engineer? What do you want to be? So I'll attend all the counseling and where I get the best seat, I'll join that. It's a nice place to be when you have a choice of plenty. Yes. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations. um i'm sure uh, prerna there are many children out over there uh, anxious to find out how is it you managed everything managed the neat and the je main and the je advance and got so many choices ahead of you so maybe can you share a few thoughts on the study techniques or strategies that you use that helped you study and balance this entire journey basically i am a neat student so i never know what je is not even the exam paper so you, as two years ago you started as a medical student you yes. wanted to join medicine yes sir like uh, before four months i started uh, to prepare for je wonderful so wonderful huh? physics and chemistry everything i concentrated in the neat part mm-hmm. the maths i went to the teachers who were present in the campus and they were so supportive to me even the principal as well pratap sir like he guided me in everything like they gave me a list of all the chapter name like uh, which one Topic is more uh, hmm. important so i just concentrated there rather than completing the whole syllabus i just thought of focusing focusing on the this especially in mathematics in yes, mathematics not even math so like uh, even in physics and chemistry i did the same thing so very interesting uh, message over here don't try to boil the ocean don't try to master all chapters be selective there are some sure shot questions that come from select chapters identify those chapters and become very strong at and it and like solve all the previous papers which are very helpful with the timer with the timer so not just read it in, a, in the bed actually do it like a test do it time yourself yes, like uh, divide the 3 hours into like whatever subject you need like physics chemistry and yeah. maths and wherever you are strong strong start it from there so start confident start with the chapter you are good at 
like if you start where we are difficult so we'll get tensed and we'll lose confidence <laughs> so i started doing from physics then i came chemistry and then last i was going to ask you what your favorite subject was so physics, physics was your was favorite physics. subject and maths was your little bit of a terror subject not like that sir but uh, uh, before four months i just know only puc part of maths Math. so i didn't even know integrated this one higher level so then i stayed in campus and then they all supported me sir wonderful wonderful Uh, which campus did you uh, graduate from? Diksha Tiagraj Nagar, yes sir. Tiagraj Nagar. Congratulations, uh, Prerna. Arya, yes, congratulations. Great job. Uh, is your parents here? Yes, sir. Can I request your parents to please come on stage? Yes. Congratulations to you all too. Thank you. Congratulations, ma'am. Proud moment. Yes. Now, whether she becomes a doctor or a uh, engineer, you all have to decide. Yeah, that is her choice. Her choice. Congratulations. Please come come in the center. Maybe we can feed your daughter a little sweet. Very nice, very nice. And a small medal for you. May this be one of many more medals to come in the years to come. Happy birthday, congratulations! Uh, anything you would like to share as parents? Good afternoon to all. Uh, respected uh, founder Diksha uh, Sridhar sir, then dear parents. Uh, first, let me congratulate all the JE qualifiers yeah, yeah. and plus uh, afternoon. The parents also here. Yes. <laughs> so because they are the stars and uh, yes, sure. today. Yes. And uh, regarding her study, already she spoke everything. So she is a need. She joined for first UC need batch, not for the JE. So this journey, okay. First UC, she uh, there are lot of option option downs for there, studying marks or scoring. So uh, second year slowly she picked stabilized. up. Stabilized. Yes. So first year was lot of ups and downs. The second year she had a rhythm. Correct. What to study, how to study. So then till uh, as she, she told, four months she is not having any thought or idea on engineering, JEE, JEE examination. So there is a jagra also between me and her. <laughs> so she told no, I am a neat candidate. Why you are forcing me to write engineering? Uh, then I told no, you are studied physics, maths, and uh, chemistry, everything for a second few, no. It's not a matter. So See, little bit you concentrate on maths. Yes. So you you start uh, for the JEE also. So then she accepted and uh, as she told she approached teachers, what and all the important chapters, where the weightage is there for the marks, how to go ahead. So finally and uh, sometimes she is watching YouTube's or uh, some uh, in the media. So what and all, uh, it's good for uh, this thing JEE. So finally when JEE main she qualified. Okay, we wondered. Okay, so she is good in JEE also. Let her write JEE main two also, also advance. Then finally she succeeded. I think it's remarkable. Uh, getting IIT Kanpur, getting in Harvard Computer Science, yes. getting And ISC. And now she got AST Indian Infrastructure Technology Aerospace. Oh, already seat confirmed. Uh, in uh, Tirunanthapuram. Tirunanthapuram. Yes, wonderful, fantastic institute by the way. It's yes. a very very nice uh, journey. You join IST. um they sponsor your whole education and they also give you a chance to join isro when you're yeah, done yeah. with it yes? so the direct so there is no written test for the job i think into uh, isro now the policy is they can directly enter into the uh, interview. isro interview when the recruitment is there they can directly enter into the interview stage yes wonderful i wish you all the very best and heartiest congratulations you, against Thank all you. of you all and uh, here i want to tell even college teachers are uh, very good uh, especially our principal pratap, pratap sir nah. So I used to interact many times, sir. Whenever you free, you call me. Don't hesitate <laughs> for your daughter's education. So if possible, even I requested, sir. She is a neat. Now she is focusing on JEE. So maths may be tough. So I didn't help. She told, sir, if you you tell me what time she is coming, I will arrange the teacher. teacher. Very very nice. In Saturdays, some two hours. Okay, I will put yes. some teacher to guide how to uh, study the maths. So good. Actually, faculty uh, as a Institute faculties are good and teachers are good and our uh, Pratap Nayar sir also encouraged so I like anything so today all uh, uh, the success means the teachers and mentors very nice very thank nice. you thank you so much all the very best let's take one quick group photograph I'd like to welcome uh, Bhuvan Prasad Bhuvan congratulations <laughs> Bhuvan scored. Uh, Uh, 2649, 2649 rank in JE Main and 1471 rank in JE Advanced. Yes, congratulations, Bhuvan. Wonderful, wonderful. 
A uh, couple of questions I have to you. To start off with, first of all, um, mains you were at 2,600, advanced you became 1,400. What was the secret for your jump in your advanced performance compared to your mains performance? I think it was like more of sing single minded focus on advance and like after mains like we really got to know how these competitive exams like really mess up with your mind on that day <laughs> so we started working on you know strengthening our concepts is one but also mentally preparing ourselves to you know face the exam. next competitive exam yeah. so the mains was like a, a prelim that got you got the idea how it's going to be a better mind space when you went for the advanced examination did you have any challenging moments that you had during your two-year journey? Or was it a nice piece of cake, a smooth road that you went through, a bed of roses? Uh, and not really, <laughs> no. I mean, I think any uh, person who has gone through this will definitely say that it's always ups and downs, never easy. Very true. And very uh, true. same for me also. Can and you share some of your ups and downs? Yeah. Uh, so uh, there are there are weekly tests which used, there were weekly tests which used to happen. And uh, obviously, marks were not always the best. And uh, you know, when you reflect on how much you have studied for that test, and then you only see a, a pretty low number, you get like really disheartened, and uh, you don't feel like you're really studying. And uh, you know, you you don't feel like doing anything after that. So I think one thing which really helped was one having a really good peer group around me. Uh, we used to study together and uh, encourage each other. And also uh, talking to our teachers, talking to my parents, it's, uh, they're always behind you, they're always ready to support you. And I think just sharing your problems with someone will help you uh, because for sure somebody will have a solution to what problems you're facing. So I think that really helped. And also, you know, just calming yourself down and keeping the end goal in mind will also really help. So there will be lots of ups and downs. When you have the downs, make sure you have someone to talk to. That's your yeah. main message. That will help you get through it at all. And keep the goal in mind, the end goal in mind, target yeah. in mind. That will help you stay focused to your end journey. Wonderful. Any other words of advice you want to share with your uh, friends and uh, juniors? Yeah, like just don't get disheartened. And I think uh, develop a good strategy, stick to it and uh, have stay some Stay the friends. course. Stay yeah. the course. Yeah. Have some friends to do it with you also. Wonderful. Are your parents here? No. no? Heartiest congratulations, uh, Bowen. Let's... Have a small felicitation and a photo. Congratulations. Wonderful. May this be the beginning of many, many more medals in the years to come. Do very well. Do you like sweets or not? You're okay with some sweet, Mumbi yeah. Takra? Yeah. <laughs> small bit. Thank you. Thanks. Let's take a picture. I forgot to ask you, so um, counseling, what has happened? Which uh, colleges have you got? What is your thought process? Yeah, currently in IIT Bombay Aerospace. Sir. IIT Bombay Aerospace. Are you looking to slide to something else? You're very I'm, happy with this I'm choice. Happy with this. Oh, actually, you wanted aerospace yeah, only, right? Yeah. That was your target and you got it and you locked it. Yes. Sir. Wonderful. All the very best. Yes. I think uh, July 29th, when is Bombay starting? Uh, August 7th. Sir. August 7th. Yeah. All the best. Yes. Thank Take you. care. Stay in touch. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Wonderful. Thank you. I'd love to invite uh, Chirag on stage. Chirag. Now, Chirag got a rank of 2159 in the JE main exam and a rank of 1920 in the JE advanced. So, you also did better in advance than in main, yes? Adios, congratulations, Chirag. Wonderful. So, maybe I'll also start with the same question with you, for you. How did you improve on your performance in advance compared to main? Well, like you had more revision time. So Between mains could... and advance. When did you say, I'm going to switch over from mains to advance? Was it immediately after attempt one or you waited till... April, May to take that decision? No, I decided that I'll finish like mains properly. Like I'll focus on mains until the second attempt. And then I was like, once I'm done with mains, then I'll focus on advanced. So I didn't like want so to So till go. April, you stayed with mains. Yeah. And I'll then after that, mains. you started advanced. And that yeah. 45 days was enough for you to crack and master advanced. Yeah, you have like the entire day is like, you don't have any classes or anything. You have the whole day for yourself. So self-study was like very much useful, I'd say. So when you have the entire day for self-study, you can like, accomplish a lot so so that time between mains and advance gave you that extra time to prepare and do yeah. well wonderful uh, any tips or tricks for mastering the je concepts what they should do how should because you learn a lot yeah i think yeah. the subjects are vast the concepts are humongous what can they do to master this plethora of concepts that children will be seeing like first of all just like get good sleep so that you don't end up <laughs> falling asleep in class so you don't want to miss out on that uh, classes so get good sleep and be attentive in class. Yeah, okay? because that's where you can learn the most. 
then whatever you learn in the class, just revise it in the end of the day. Like try to recall it without looking at your notes. And ah. then uh, if you're unable to do so, then just take a look, make sure, just check how much have you got. By the end, you'll be able to do quite a bit. Very interesting. So as a technique, you said when you went back home, you would not open the book and read. You yeah. close the book and try to recap in your mind, what did my teacher teach? What all concept, yeah. what problem, how, what is the trick in the problem? How do you solve the problem? Yeah. You mentally went through the whole lecture again in your mind. Yeah, Yeah, really. Fantastic. Me, just to grasp the concept. Like, this is a new idea I've heard and it helps imprint the idea in your mind. And then if you're stuck up somewhere, open the book and refer it and, and review it. Yeah. Very so, nice, very nice. Uh, like the easy concepts and stuff like most people will be able to get. The only thing you have to focus is on revision. Like whenever tests come, I guess you can do the revision at that point itself. But the harder concept like, will be like difficult for majority of the people. Right, right. So in those kind of cases, like you can ask your teachers for help. But if you're still unable to understand, like you can go for reference books and stuff. And instead of going like for like some like different different reference books and taking like uh, help from all of them, just like stick to one and just instantly because then you can just confuse yourself uh, in the end of the day. That's a very valid point you have there. That today's time, children have access to humongous information. Yeah, digital versions of so many books. And parents are excited, they've been printed versions of X number of books. Yeah. So your advice is don't try to do too many books. Choose yeah. one book, but finish it thoroughly. Yeah. yeah Go exactly. deep as opposed to going wide. Yes. Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. So that was what I want to say. Excellent, excellent. Are your parents here by any chance? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Can I please invite your mother over? Heartiest congratulations. <laughs> wonderful. Chirag, you can come to the center. Any words you'd like to share, ma'am, of Chirag's journey and any advice to other parents who are listening in on this? Like his, he was in uh, hostel bachelor, so he was he was staying in a hostel, so we didn't worry much about his studies. Study was you stayed in hostel through the night also, or a little eight o'clock? No, we were yeah. through, through the night. night. Oh, yeah, so your role was very limited. Bachelor. Okay. So he was staying in hostel, so study part was uh, taken Deeksha. care in Diksha by <laughs> teachers and the admin staff. So um, other than that. Uh, we were only worried about his health and <laughs> food and health. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. We are very happy very and nice. proud parents. How much did you push him academically? I need you to get this mask, you can do better. Yeah. Did you have much time to do that or not much need he for that? I didn't say that, uh, you know, get this much. I said, give your best. Yes. So don't regret it later because these are the two years it will not come back. Very, so. yeah, very nice valid yeah. point to parents. Your message is not, hey, I need you to get 1000 rank or 100 rank. I need you to do your best. Give your best. And the, do your best is not to get 100 rank. Do your best so that tomorrow you will not regret. That I didn't do my best. Yeah? I didn't uh, tell him don't compare yourself with others. Just see how you were yesterday and today and improve upon. It's a journey so with think, yourself yeah, rather yourself, than with others. Yeah, no. Very, very nice. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Let me have a small felicitation. Congratulations, Chirag. All the very best. May you get many, many more laurels and medals in the years to come. Ma'am, would you like to share a small sweet with him or a big sweet also? Whatever he likes. Just give me a small piece. Just a small piece. <laughs> yes, lovely. And uh, Chirag, uh, counseling, where have you got? What are you planning to do? What, what's happened at the first round? I got Rurki Electrical. Electrical? Mm, and I got Bits Pilani CS. So, oh, so you're debating. deciding between those two. Bits Pilani CS and uh, Rurki Electrical, all great choices, I'm sure. Wherever you go, you'll excel and you'll shine. I wish you all the very best. Artist, congratulations. Thank you. Let's do one group photograph. Come closer. Super, lovely. Very, very nice words of messages to your children. You guys are doing great. Look forward to more stories and more such sharings. Yes. I would like to thank all the teachers who are very accessible to him. Even when he used to come home, they used to check, like, especially up? Lakshmi ma'am, like, <laughs> I don't know. That time when they were there, it's like a sort of torture for them, but I think it uh, ended, up, uh, <laughs> yeah, ended up uh, good. Uh, yeah. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. I'd like to invite Abhinav. A big round of applause to Abhinav. Congratulations, Abhinav. Abhinav scored a 2074 rank in JE Main and 2264th rank in JE Advanced. Uh, so Abhinav, a question for you. Uh, at Diksha, um, we have a lot of tests, right? We do a test every Friday, test every Monday, end of the week revision test, end of the chapter mock test, revision series test, grand test, and multiple tests. So quick question to you, and I'm sure many students there are also uh, anxious to know, how important 
way these weekly tests, the end of the year practice tests, mock tests, grand tests in getting you ready to be able to crack the exam. 2000 rank you got in both the main and advanced, phenomenal performance. How, what role did these tests play in your entire journey and your preparation? So I would like to say all these uh, weekly tests which are conducted every two weeks, they are to test the concepts you have learnt in those two particular weeks. So they, the scores you get in those tests will definitely impact the mock tests you take at the end of the year, but you should not get disheartened by the scores you get in them. Because uh, there will always be topics you are weak in and you are strong in. So those tests are just there to remind you what you are lacking in and for you to improve on those topics. So your point is use the test to find out your gaps and cover those gaps. Yes. So uh, test is not only about marks, test is about going and closing the gaps after the test is done. Yes. So the main thing that uh, like people do and I used to do it in the beginning of the year is you are done with the weekly test or oh, you saw the score, you are done. <laughs> You don't go through the paper. You don't. You won't go through the paper. You don't re, uh, re, like review your mistakes. You don't like solve the problems again. Like you don't need to do the whole paper again, but at least like see where you have missed, what concepts you have to learn, and do that. Because if you don't do that, you can't like expect your scores to magically improve. So the tests actually are worthwhile when you go back and review it. Just writing the test per se makes you faster mainly, but doesn't help you as much as you will by going and reviewing the test afterwards. Yes, and uh, the actual things which will uh, reflect on your final like J mains and advanced course are the end of the year mock test. Mock uh, test. So those will actually tell you uh, like what like major thing you are lacking in and you learn time management from Very true. And you balance across subjects, across time, you're able to balance to go on. So net net, should children write tests regularly or not? Yes, they absolutely, they yes. <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you so very much, uh, Abhinav. Are your parents here by any chance? Oh my God. I request Abhinav's father kindly come in. Are your congratulations, yes. sir. Yes. How moment for you. Yes, yes Abhinav, yes. come closer. Anything you'd like to share, sir, about Abhinav's journey and maybe to other parents as to... He is a continuously studying it. I'm not sure this one. Uh, He's self-motivated regularly. Yes, yes, sir. Okay, uh, lucky. One thing, I'm a lucky person. And another thing, I'm only pushing him. Do it extra mile. Do it extra mile. <laughs> he done it. He kept listening and following up. Yes, yes. It's all because of the Diksha family. I can tell you. Teachers, yes, all the teachers definitely have been working very hard and tirelessly behind the scenes to help all the children. Always indebted and grateful to them. And a fantastic job by all of you all. After your congratulations once again. Thanks. Congratulations to you, sir. You'll have a small bouquet. There you go. May this bring many, many more laurels and medals to you in the years to come. All the very best. You like sweets? Uh, sort of, a little bit. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. We'll just do one group photograph. Counseling, where have you got? Which college? What are you planning to do? In the first two rounds, I got uh, IT Jodhpur Computer Science. Computer Science, so waiting for the for the rounds. Next yeah. rounds with the signing and going on. Wonderful. Have you also done uh, bits or not written bits? Uh, bits I have done, but I didn't participate in the counseling. So, so IIT, you're very clear about it. Yes. yes. Wonderful. All the very best. Jodhpur IIT is also wonderful, and Computer Science Dean Department. All the very best. Yes. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank All you. the best. Let's give a big round of applause to Varun Malia. Varun Malia, congratulations. So Varun uh, got uh, 4,193rd rank in JE Main and uh, 3,656 rank in JE Advance. Um, counseling is over. First round of, second round of First counseling. Round yes, where are you looking at? Uh, sir, I wanted to go into fundamental physics. So I put uh, IIT Roorkee Engineering Physics. First. Ah. I got it. Your choice. Your but choice now, was engineering physics. Ah. Now I'm thinking of uh, you know going into electrical or mechanical in other places. So what's your chance you may slide into? Which... Roorkee Mechanical and Indoor Electrical. Okay. So, so you're waiting to see next yes. uh, week or so you'll get the finalization. Yes. All the very best. Thank you, sir. I'm sure you'll do well and all colleges are great. You'll do phenomenally well. Have a jolly time over there. I think next four years of undergraduate studies you will do extremely well. So here's a question for you. Um, there's something I hear very often from uh, uh, students. Sir, I studied very hard, I prepared, I practiced, I knew everything, sir. But I went to the examination, I opened my paper and suddenly blank. I know that question, but I don't know how to answer it. Yeah, That panic sets in, the anxiety sets in, it, it um, stops them from performing well. So question to you, uh, did you have issues of exam anxiety? How did you manage it? And more importantly, how do you bring out the best in you? End of the day, that's all we can hope for. Study hard, 
when we go for the examination, what I have should come up. Yeah. What did you do and, and any advice to children about that? So I actually didn't perform as well as I wanted in the first mains attempt. It's because I had issues with anxiety during the exam. So what happened to me was uh, my hands started shaking when... In the exam. Yeah, actually in the, in the exam. In the exam. <laughs> uh, in, like in the, the first one, JEE main yes, one. attempt one. Uh. In the last one hour or so when I was attempting maths, I was not able to finish even one question properly. Uh. Uh, but that was because I took one question, I solved it for 15 seconds. And then when I thought I couldn't do it, I moved on to the next. And I did this for like 15, 20 questions. In the end, I managed to solve about... 10 questions in total. But and you were I was, more worried about I'm not getting it, I'm not getting it, yeah. and that kept uh, clouding you as you kept moving yes. further down. So, so I would more say, anxiety. I would say take one question, solve it as much as you can, keep a timer, for example, three or four minutes minimum, solve a question. And if you don't get it within that time, only then move into the next question. I would say don't move into the next question thinking this this is not going to happen at all. Because it will. <laughs> so, very important advice you're saying, hey, number one, be selective, choose your question wisely. Having chosen the question, give it a fair shot, at least three, four minutes, attempt it. If after the three, four minutes is not working, don't stay locked on for 20 minutes, move on to the next question, yes. doesn't matter. Yes. But then give it that fair shot and choose your questions wisely. And uh, Shreya was also telling earlier, hey, I just focused on certain chapters, became very solid at that. So, same over here, there are 30 questions or the 18 questions, choose your questions for the chapter you're good at. Work at it, finish it, build up the confidence and go on. So what changed between attempt one and attempt two? What I did was uh, whenever anxiety struck me in ah, the second okay. attempt, ah. uh, I just sat for about a minute or so. I just put closed the pen my, down. Yeah, I put the pen down, closed my eyes and sat. And what, what did you think? Because that's an, you were anxiety will build up, right? Time is getting wasted and I'm not able to do my question. I cleared all that out of my mind. Deep breathing. Just, yeah. just, just deep breath, yes. calm down. Yes. Okay, wonderful. And, and then you went back in. Yeah, again. I, I just, just went, went back, back in and the questions were getting solved. The second attempt went much better in maths than the first, first attempt. attempt. Yes. And then JE Advance also you did very well, 4000 over there as well. And did you have a panic and anxiety attack in JE Advance? No. Or whether you were veteran I, at this? I cleared it in the first mains attempt. No, I would say taking an exam, taking a major exam properly, especially mains attempt one, is going to clear everything. Like for the main set attempt two and for advance. So, just like um, uh, Bhuvan also said, it's the first exam that you write, all anxieties, everything build up, tensions build up. But with the second and third exam, you're a veteran. You know what to do, you can take it forward. I think you really tackled a question many children grapple with over there. Exam anxiety when they get in the examination hall. I think very, very nice points you had, Varun. Thank you so much. Are your parents here? Thanks. Joining you here? Okay, then let me have a small round of felicitation, a round of applause for you. Thank you. Here you go. Thank you. Happy yes, congratulations. And look forward to you earning more such laurels and medals in the years to come. Yes. Very, very nice points, very valid points. I think a lot of the topics you are talking about, very relevant to the students out over there. Thank you so much for taking your time and sharing your, your messages. And trust me, I can say many of these things or parents can say many of these things, children don't listen to us. Yeah, When your peer group tells you, it makes more difference. When children were in kindergarten, one, two and three, they would listen to mommy, daddy. Then by four, five, six, mommy, you're wrong, teacher is right. <laughs> four, five, six, seven, eight. By nine, ten, eleven, twelve, teacher is also not right, my friends are correct. Yeah, the peers matter. So really very, very nice sharing your journeys and your uh, experiences as well. I'd like to welcome Pranav Bhatt onto the stage. Pranav. Congratulations, Pranav. So, Pranav scored JE Advanced rank 4385. And uh, Pranav, you finished your counseling? Uh, yes, sir. What is your college you're getting in? What are uh, your options you're exploring? I'll be going to Bitspilani CS or uh, NIT Suratkal IT. Okay, so through IIT, you got other departments? Yes, I got in, but I'd, in the preference order. You prefer computer, computer science, science or IT yeah, in uh, NIT than. and in BITS? Yes, sir. All amazing institutions, lovely choices, all the very best. Yes, sir. So the two-year journey is a long journey, and here's a question for you. Uh, the two-year journey is a long journey, and I'm sure uh, you didn't finish that journey by just studying one day before the exam. You must have studied throughout your two years. And uh, typically, per day, how many hours did you go back home and study initially? Uh, so normally, I study like four to five hours. Four to five day. hours daily. Yeah. And as it came closer to the examination, towards the end, last two months before the exam, 
for 5 hours it became 7 8 hours yeah, like i would say consistently 10 maybe because i had a lot of time like more time so yeah, at least 10 hours. hours so question to you these are long periods of time 10 hours of study 5 hours of study and there is a long periods of time how do you stay focused during these long study sessions uh, sir so i would say like the focusing part comes mainly down to how much you want to really crack these exams like in like intrinsic motivation should be there uh, so like a senior told me this like i always uh, like he always remembered like reminded himself that there is someone of his own iq level yeah. who is doing better than you if you waste time so i kept <laughs> on like reminding myself of the same thing like there might be someone else in some corner of india who is like do reading and doing the same thing that i am doing but if i end up wasting time like he might end up becoming better One than me. so that like whenever i try to waste time or like switch up what for. your friend would say uh, so that's one thing that like kept on motivating me like rather than anyone else telling me anything. so it was more of self motivation yeah. setting your goal and realizing to yourself that hey i need to put in this effort because i need to accomplish yes. some goal and target over there yes. very nice wonderful any other words of advice you have for your uh, juniors and so like, other aspirants like, uh, the importance of asking doubts like throughout huh? the day like all the subjects like in especially in physics like it's a subject where you like tend to make a lot of misconceptions in topics very true very true like so it's better if you ask the doubts in the class rather than it come back it'll come back and haunt you during the exam like it has a very valid also. point uh, yes, that especially in 11th standard children are very hesitant you know nervous to ask doubt you don't ask doubts and then you're right if you have a doubt it stays inside it will grow up your foundation will be weak and in the examination will come to haunt you yeah. yes? yes so your question your point is hey please ask your doubt yes. either in the classroom in the corridor or to your friend Anywhere. make yeah. sure your doubt is clarified yeah, yes, that's sir. the single most important advice you have to your uh, friends get your doubts clarified wonderful any other any other thoughts you want to share uh, not exactly it's like it's not over until it's actually over like ah, last exam is ji advance so even if you get demotivated by maybe je main so some other exam i don't see a je main rank over here so what is your je main rank sir 5404 so 5000 you may have been demotivated but then you said hey it's not over till it's done and 4000 you got in your je yes. advance you improved it better yes. i think wonderful excellent staying focus gets the job done yes, yes. excellent are your parents here with you sir uh, can i request nana's mother to kindly join us yes. please come come to the center Congratulations, ma'am. Must be proud. Yeah. Any words you'd like to share about Pranav studies or journey or any advice to other parents? Actually, he's self-motivated. That's what he said yeah, in the beginning. Yeah. I should be. From the day one, goal. he was focusing only on advance. Oh, he was clear advance. Yeah. Advance is a goal and target. Very nice. Very nice. If in between uh, he get demotivated. he used to remind that my focus is yes, on advance i will study i will do that over it set the goal did you write on the board somewhere joining iit or joining uh, yeah, nit did you put something there it was always there in your mind yes sir <laughs> wonderful yes, sir. artis congratulations yes, again let's have a small bouquet for you thank you we have many more such moments yes. of sharing laurels okay. and ma'am lovely lovely in the one group photograph i'd like to invite antonio antonio mm -hmm. derek hardiest congratulations antonio So Antonio secured the uh, 4,461st rank in the JE Advance examination. And um, Antonio, a quick question for you. Yes. Um, you were just sharing with me before we started this conversation that, sir, um, my journey was also not a bed of roses. There were lots of ups and downs. There were many moments where you got low marks in the tests that were conducted. Yeah. Uh, yes. What did you do? How did you pull yourself out? Usually, you get low marks. You get demotivated. You don't feel like studying. You don't study. you again get even lower marks it becomes a downward spiral how do you break out of it and come out and stay motivated when you get low marks so you know one thing that helped me whenever i got low marks was i used to focus on the long term goal of g like i'm not going to let these low marks like uh, disrupt my preparation so like whenever i focus on my long term j goals it helped me to like forget about these low marks and start preparing for the next one better and i also had a very good peer group around me who supported me my teachers and especially my dean minu ma'am she always used to encourage me whenever i got low marks and that really helped me to focus better and prepare for the next one 
So keep your goal in mind, keep your end goal in mind, and have a good group of friends yes, yeah, who'll be able to work with you and take you along. Wonderful, heartiest congratulations, Antonio. Thank Are you, your sir. parents here? Oh, yes, my mom's here. Can I request Antonio's mom to kindly join us? Congratulations, ma'am. Main thing that could help us uh, get through as parents and uh, you know, uh, help my son was uh, motivating him, especially, uh, you know, keeping his mind uh, free whenever he gets, you know, stressed. really stressed <laughs> and these marks, because he was always kind of, you know, uh, top of his class. So first he took some time to understand how difficult these uh, exams, exams were and to understand that there is so much competition around him and, you know, how for him his... Uh, entire inspiration comes from topping his class oh, which was not good. happening yeah. so that was like frustrating Bugging him <laughs> a lot and uh, my husband uh, just just before he started his second year he just moved uh, outside the country so i was i was over stressed you know <laughs> since the entire burden fell on me on you, so yes. but we are happy we kept praying for him and uh, he just uh, kept his focus on and uh, i'm just happy that you know he, he just reached his goal no. And that is all, yeah. Wonderful. Which college have you got in your uh, counseling? Right now, uh, IIT oh, of uh, Engineering Physics. Wonderful. Wonderful. And Wonderful. Fixed planning GVLTT. Okay, so you're debating which amongst you to go, or IIT is your clear choice? I'm still waiting to see if there's any further problems. Slides and what happens, happens over there. Yes, yeah. wonderful. Yes, congratulations, congratulations once again. again. There you go. Can you look there as well? We pray you get many, many more such medals in the years to come. Thank you, sir. Ma'am, little sweets for the occasion. All the very best. Thank you, sir. Please say that, yeah? Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I'd like to invite Samvid on stage. Hi, Samvid. Heartiest congratulations. Samved scored uh, 2589, 2500 rank in JE Main and 4400 rank in the JE Advanced exam. And uh, what are your options? What are the colleges you are looking at uh, now? So I've frozen NITKC as a result. Computer Science NIT yeah. Suratkal. Congratulations. Thank All the very best. Uh, so here's a question for you. Uh, I'm sure the uh, two year journey uh, would have had a lot of pressure, stress, mm -hmm. yeah, stress uh, from peer group, parents, teachers, your own expectations, etc. So how do you manage the pressure and stress during this two-year journey? So there are basically like two kinds of stress that a student can face. Well, the stress during when you're preparing for the exam, just, you know, during the middle, when you're preparing during the exam, the one way to deal with that is just focus on the present. Look at your weekly tests, see how your results go and try improving on that. So Don't important, we're saying focus on the moment yeah. uh, because very often stress comes and I write the examination and I get bad marks. Yeah. yeah, and then I'm thinking about my marks, thinking about the next marks that I'm going to get, and I start yeah. getting worked up now. Thinking about the final exam, how it's going to go, what if this happens in the final exam? What if you start thinking yeah. about this? How do you get over that? So yeah? just try avoiding those emotions, you know, just stay calm, stay in the moments. Try preparing what you're doing right now. Just so all you can do is your effort. Yeah. Do that effort, focus and on the effort. Will be Don't worry about yeah. the goal which is over there. Okay, that is while you're studying. Yeah. You'll also get stressed later on. Yeah, during the exam itself. <laughs> Very so, the, so the one way to deal with that is I used to meditate just before the exam. Like I'd reach the In the exam hall? Yeah, I'd reach the exam hall maybe like 45 minutes. Tell us minutes, more about it. Huh? 45 minutes early and i just sit there in front of the computer and just, you know, close my eyes and just calm myself down, keep my breathing in check. So huh. that's how I would deal with the exam hall. And then I would just wait for the finish line of the exam to come. Like when three hours is over, okay. when the six hours is over, I just look at what for that to happen. That's all. So that's one way I so use Very nice. Answer. So by regulating your breathing and keeping your focus on the immediate goal, you're able to just yeah. calm yourself down yeah. and just go through the exam. Don't yeah. be worried. Don't be stressed over the exam and keep yeah. it going. I think great. Many, many children go through that same question, sir. I'm so stressed. What do I do? Yeah. Uh, Samir has some good advice for you all and choices for you all. Thank you very much, Samir. Are your parents here today? Yeah. My I request Samir's parents to kindly join us. Yeah. Adios, congratulations. Congratulations. Yes. Yes, uh, as parents, any words of advice or any thoughts you'll have when other parents can be listening in? Uh, firstly, we'd like to thank uh, Lakshmi ma'am and uh, Murali sir for all the support. Continuous mentoring. Al yes. Always uh, approachable and then supporting 
parents as well as children, many doubts. I used to have a lot of doubts and, uh, <laughs> as, parent. as, as yeah. a parent. So um, as, as an advice to other parents is just just uh, encourage them to do, do their best and don't pressurize them. Probably I was doing a bit uh, in, in, in first year or so then. Uh, so I should ask, did your parents, parents pressurize you? A bit and then I just... And was it good them. pressure or bad pressure? He <laughs> said ease off. Yeah, huh? that's right. <laughs> but but uh, after, after a certain point of time, we just left it to him. Exactly. Right? Even, even for the counseling also. So there are a lot of discussion happening whether to go with any of the IIT yes. branches, which is not of interest. Or, or he was very specific. He wants computer science. science. Yes. Uh, and then uh, we are from Mangalore, so there is an so average advantage. Very close by, yeah, yes. Closeness. <laughs> so just leave it to them, whatever they want to do. Don't pressurize them and encourage them, actually. And do, I mean, always remind them, do your best. So a little bit of pressure, get them on track. Once they're on That's track, it, yeah. ease off. Yeah. yeah, let them go on. Let them go that on. That initial so stage is important that they get the rhythm. They get the rhythm and they set. To be honest with you, some way it was good. Like, probably if I, when I was crossing a line, so I know it's, an, it's in my control. So... And we used to leave him uh, there. Let him go. Just encourage him wherever they do your best. And then probably uh, he was a hostelite actually. So most thing is like uh, take care of your health and then food habits. Sleep well. Yeah, that's, that was the probably more, more of a discussion when he used to call uh, once in two days. Uh, had your uh, sleep and had a good sleep or had your food. And then did you take bath? And <laughs> yeah. those, kind of, those are the, those are the, the discussions rather than uh, more about the study part. Actually. But you know what? Actually, in this journey, more than the dad is the mom who's the one who's really stressed out and going the ups and downs. Anything you'd like to share, ma'am? That is what my stress is all taken care by Lakshmi ma'am and the, yeah, <laughs> and the teachers there. Food, health, health, health and well being. Yeah. Yes, sleep, food, and, uh, yeah. and uh, keep hygiene. yourself calm. calm. That's the thing. Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. Congratulations once, once again. again. I have a small bouquet for you. There you go. We pray you have many more such laurels in the years to come. And you can... A lot of choices for yes. some reason. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good. <laughs> okay. Good. Thank you all the very best. And thank you again for coming. Pleasure having you here. Thank you. Well, welcome Sanjay Max. Congratulations. Now, uh, Sanjay got uh, 2420th rank in the JE main and uh, 4968 in JE advance. Uh, what are you planning to do, Sanjay? Oh. Have you chosen your law choices and your colleges? Yeah, in the first round of Joseph Counseling, I got NITK CS and I'm, I have everything. So, CS, CS it is, NITK. Congratulations. Very, very nice. Wonderful. So, uh, um, Sanjay had an interesting story. So uh, uh, he was in a different campus uh, studying for the JE main. And then I think in your second year, you moved to uh, uh, the Diksha main campus. You came to the main campus and came to a different group of friends and the whole level was like bumped up two notches higher. So it was a big shock for him coming in over there. Uh, so my question to you, uh, this whole transition, this whole change, um, what role did your friends play in all of it? Did you do group studies? Did you talk to people to get it out clarified. How do you transit and, and get into that next level of your studies and preparations? So I was used to being alone later. in this journey uh, in the entirety of first year and uh, second year. But uh, as soon as the revision classes started in November of last year, my teachers uh, decided to shift me to the main, main campus, campus so that uh, they could uh, challenge my uh, rigor and training. So when I first came to the main campus, I met this incredible peer. Uh, they had and uh, a call out to anyone, a special call out to your friends. I would call out <laughs> everyone, including Varun, Nandan, mm -hmm. Bhuvan, and Prithvi, who and Avyakta, who were all there for me and they accepted me as their own from the beginning. Yes, uh, very not well. as an outsider. So, what we used to do were uh, we used to take a big topic and we divided it into many subtopics, which we used to cover in an hour. And, or half so an amongst hour. yourself you divide it and each one would focus on that subtopic yes. and each one would spend one hour studying it and then what after that? And then we used to get together and uh, we used to mark the important questions and doubts which we used to ask each in other. In your portion. Yeah. It's very interesting actually. Here's something I hear. So there is a lot of content you will get. There's a lot of books that you will see. There's unlimited number of books and you don't have time to go through it all. So here uh, Sanjay and his friends did something smart. They divided and conquered it. We divided the books or the material, reviewed it, and then marked the interesting questions, the questions with difficulties, with doubts, and then pulled it together and discussed it together. I yes. think brilliant. I think it's amazing. Uh, this is something I think all children should form, form a small group 
and work together to to finish it up. So you're able to cover more material that so, way. So you could do. We were yeah. able to cover everything within uh, well within time, and we used to discover more books and more more interesting and, questions and more and, uh, problems. Something which were out of syllabus, which might come in hand in the exam. You able uh, to find them, discuss them, and then and take it forward. Wonderful. Any other words of advice to your uh, friends? Uh, just say my juniors to always believe in yourself and not get demotivated because all these mock tests and uh, practices are just for you for you to motivate yourself and just for practice never get disheartened when you score low because the j mains is the final one the mocks <laughs> don't matter mocks don't matter the final exam that matters use these to improve and get better yeah wonderful hartias congratulations sanjay are your parents here yes, with you today can i request sanjay's mother to kindly come Uh, very happy with this performance. Wonderful. Happiest congratulations. Let me have a small bouquet for you. There you go. And we look forward to many, many more such laurels in the years to come. You can put a small sweet in his mouth. There you go. <laughs> Wonderful! A round of applause, and let's do one group photo. I welcome Nandan Prasad. Hi, Nandan! Heartiest congratulations. So, Nandan scored six thousand eight hundred eighty-fifth rank in the JE Advanced uh, exam. And uh, Nandan, your first round of counselling is all over. Uh, Where yeah. are you uh, looking at? For now, I've got uh, engineering physics in IIT Indore. I didn't know engineering I'm physics. Very good. The sliding to happen, and do you have any options in NIT or uh, uh, bits? I have computer science in bits, Pilani, but uh, and still that like so for now there. there's another option. But then IIT is what you're yeah. angling for, I'm Mostly. sure. All great choices. I wish you all the best. I'm sure you'll do very well. Here's a, a question for you. Um, Two-year journey, long journey. You've studied hard, gone through it all, uh, and there's a lot of tests we give you at Diksha also. The question: How helpful were The previous year's question papers. Did you actually go through them? Did you do like a test? Did you review it, or did you look at it chapter wise? The whole previous year's paper. What role did it play in your JE advance? I'd say uh, if you were to do just one set of questions for your preparation, it would be the previous year questions. So that's that most is, important. Yeah, that definitely, 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 definitely do the it. most important part of preparation you can do, and you right. should always try and do that. Right. I feel like the. Pattern of questions, especially in mains and even other competitive exams like BITS and CET and all, the pattern itself doesn't change much year to year. Like uh, from some topics, you get similar questions, you get the same level of questions, difficulty. you get difficulty of uh, sim same level. And doing previous year questions, especially timed, will help you understand at what level you are and at what level the exam is and what you can expect from the exam. So do it like an exam, not like reading a book. Yeah. Yes. How yeah. many such papers do you actually do for every exam? Uh, Four is, papers, ten papers, twenty papers. How many years in the back? No, you go? Maximum. Like <laughs> as far as I can say, you should just keep doing till the exam comes. Start from recent years and just keep doing. Uh, at least ten papers is what we try to aim for. Uh, to get a good each. handle of what that exam is yeah, about. Yeah, for uh, mains and advanced, at least ten papers we try. And the important thing is time it. Yeah. yeah. Did you do anything else uh, other than academics to balance yourself to to calm I mean, yourself? Or? Yeah, uh, my brother and me we were both into music, so mm -hmm. I felt uh, like especially when we used to practice together and stuff, it it used to like it used to be a change of pace rather than academics. We used to focus on something else. It used music to music as in classical music. Yeah, both Carnatic classical and Western vocals piano, or, or vocals and vocals. Western piano. And Western piano. So uh, this is very interesting. Either of those would like really. Give us a completely different thing to focus on. It would so be, while studying for J.E. and J.E. Advance, you had time to do music and piano. Yeah, we tried to make time for it as far as we could to relax. How many hours every week uh, or every day? It became tougher as it went, so uh, it got to about three hours every week or so. You were able to yeah. actually do this, yeah. and this helped you a lot. Yeah, yes, yeah definitely. So your advice so, would be to children: Hey, if you have a hobby, don't stop it. Yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. don't yeah. stop it. Especially when you're feeling low or something, doing that will completely say it goes a little bad. But then you don't have something to worry about. It's just something you're doing to relax yourself, not you know 
something that you are aiming for at a JE advanced level. So. And being relaxed and in a frame of mind to be fresh definitely helps you in your study. Yeah, again, next yeah? day will go a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. Lovely words of advice. Um, do you have any, your parents here with you joining us today? No. no? Yeah. Okay, then let me give you a small bouquet. Congratulations. And we wish you all the best in all your future endeavors. Keep getting more such laurels and trophies. You like sweet? Uh, Big sweet, shall I put in your mouth? Little, little sweet. sweet. <laughs> little? Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah, there will be many such sweet moments. Bo and Nandan are twins together. Both have aced the examinations. Excellent. Thank you. All the best. Thanks. I invite Shantapa to join us. Hi, Shantapa. RTS, congratulations. Uh, Shantapa has scored uh, rank uh, 2,675, a category rank in JE main examinations. Uh, and Shantapa, where are you planning to join? Where you want NITK to go? School, NITK. NITK, what department ECI. have you got? ECI, I have got, and in further ones, I will get CSA. So electronics already, and confident of getting computer science. Yes, all the very best. Thank you. Do very well. So uh, Shantapa, you were also in a hostel, if I'm right, right? Yeah, you were, Shantapa studied in a hostel and did two years in a hostel. Uh, in a hostel, you get time to do other things. So did you have a chance to play games and extracurricular activities? And how important was that in your whole journey of your two years? We used to get time, but usually I did not participate in those things because we won't get enough time to sleep. And if <laughs> you go there, we can't manage things. Okay. Huh. And, but friends supported me a lot. What role did your friends play in your two years? Yeah, classes, we will just be concentrating on studies. And if we just concentrate on studies, we can't, our mind will not be always calm. Get tired. Tired. Uh -huh. So I, friends played a very important role. And they will always be like, moments, they will be disturbing in class. <laughs> and even it played a best role. And if I explain them some doubts, I, I can boost my confidence. In the so by teaching your friends, you learn the subject yourself better. Yeah. And friends brought the smile in your face. Yeah, yes. it was always nice to have friends. So friends were critical in your entire two-year journey. I hope these friends stay with you for life. And each of you all will go in different paths, different directions. I wish you all the very best. Are your parents here with you? I request uh, Shantapa's uh, mother to kindly join us. Come to the center. Congratulations, ma'am. Wonderful. Would you like to share a few words, ma'am? Anything to share? No? Let me give you a small bouquet. Congratulations. We pray you get many, many more such medals in the years to come. All the best. Wonderful. All the best. Stay in touch. And NIT, come to the All the best. Do that. I'd like to invite uh, Sampreet. Hi, Sampreet. Congratulations. So Sampreet scored the 3142nd rank in the JE main examinations. Amazing job, Sampreet. Congratulations once again. And uh, what happened in Josa Counseling? You can come to the center. Josa uh, Counseling. Josa Counseling. In the second round, I got NIT Suratkal CS. Oh, Computer Science NIT Suratkal. Lucky Ajay. Yeah. All done. Sorted. I also have BITS as an option. BITS CS. Yes. BITS Computer Science. Yeah. Oh, good choices. What are you inclined towards doing? Uh, NIT only. On NIT. Course. Both great universities, great colleges. All the very best. RTS, congratulations. Uh, I have a question for you. Um, who was your biggest or what was your biggest support system during your entire two-year journey to helping you achieve the success? I'm sure there have been lots of ups and downs. Who was there to prop you up and to get you past the finish line? Uh, I had many sources of support. Uh, number one being my peer group. We didn't have many group studies, but we had a WhatsApp group for group discussions of doubts. Ah. That was my main source of learning. So, one minute. So, you actually had a group of four or five friends and whenever you have a doubt, you post it to yeah. your group and another friend would answer it. Yeah. Oh, oh, lovely. Yeah. I think it's brilliant. That I think every student out there should form a group. From and your friends? Yeah. Super. Super. And uh, second source will be my parents. They supported me throughout uh, two years. And then... So, when you had your up and down, what do your parents do? Uh, they were happy with whatever marks I got and they kept supporting me to do better. Keep aiming high, yeah. don't worry, keep the uh, process going yeah. on. And I also had the 
Diksha teachers. Parents and teachers, yes. And one more source uh, which I had is uh, there are many online content for JE concepts and all. Uh, those will teach you concepts, but I used to look at some science YouTube channels mm. and they would uh, show the applications of what we learn and rather than problem solving yeah. the application of yeah. it and where it's actually what scientists and engineers would do in uh, currently. Yeah. yeah, so that would motivate me and make me more receptive in the class. Yeah. Wonderful. Paying attention in class was important. Uh, the yeah, it was very important. They will pay attention over there. Wonderful, excellent. Are your parents here with you? Can I request uh, Sampreet's parents, mother and father to kindly come? Congratulations, proud moment for you all. Congratulations, please come. Any uh, uh, thoughts you all have you'd like to share with the other parents uh, and children? I thank uh, Elhanka branch of uh, Diksha, the, especially Rashmi ma'am, Neeti ma'am, R.D. Kesar, M. Kesar. And all the staff have given very good cooperation uh, because first year uh, out of this COVID, uh, no classes, uh, all uh, online only. October now only one year came. they attended uh, physical classes. Uh, yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. And yeah. he has put uh, good all efforts. his good yes. efforts and uh, all the staff has uh, encouraged and uh, I mean, you know, all his success so <laughs> goes to. Thank you. Uh, Most welcome. Very nice. proud of uh, something. I wish you all the very best. Can I have a small bouquet? Congratulations. We pray for many more such occasions where you have wonderful medals and laurels. You can give them a sweep, you can put them out. Thank you. Thank you. We'll just have one. Come closer, ma'am. Have one good picture. Congratulations, and Sampreet. Thank All the very best. Stay in touch. Thank you. Thank you, and congratulations. Congratulations. So I'd like to invite Ritwik. Ritwik Sharan. Hi, Ritwik. Heartiest congratulations. Thank Wonderful. So Ritwik scored uh, the 4,347th rank uh, in JE Main, a category rank he had gotten, and uh, counseling is now done. It's going on. So what is your first round of counseling? What have you got? I've gotten EC in an ITK. An IIT computer, uh, electronics. Yeah. Wonderful. And hoping to slide to hoping IT to or to computer slide. science. Wonderful. All the very best. I, I you, wish you very well in whichever college you do and Thank what you, you do. Um, important question, I think, which is very relevant for all children. Um, there's a lot of content to study subject wise and how to manage. All of children over here have written JE first time, cracked it. Yeah, you also first attempt. So you have to balance your both studies along with your competitive studies. So it's all about time management. Yeah. Any advice and suggestion to your juniors, how to manage time, how to cover the syllabus and how to pace themselves over the next two years. Uh, so first of all, a normal schedule of an average human is actually enough to crack JE. And eight hours of, eight hour of sleep is very uh, mandatory. And uh, four to six hours of studying is actually enough. 16 to 18 hours is just overhyped. Not yeah, not, not necessary. necessary at all. So efficient four to six studies. hours and efficient studies and eight hours of sleep. Yeah, yes. That's your mantra. Okay. Yes. What to do in that four to six hours? Like uh, How to balance between daily studies, studying for the exam, weekly tests, studying for board. How do you balance all of it? Uh, first of all, start with your favorite subject. Okay. Which in my case was uh, physics or math. So daily you go back home, you'll start with physics or maths. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, in the end, I would like touch chemistry almost all. And, uh, How about for the test? Did you study for the test earlier on a Sunday or you started studying from the beginning of the week? How do you balance between daily studies and test for, test studies? It's like uh, half the week, just after the test got over, after uh, realizing the mistakes, I would do my own analysis track, and own track, uh, different uh, lessons, different okay. concepts. The other half of the week when the test is nearing, I would uh, study for the test. So at least four or five days before the test, you start preparing for the test along with your daily studies. Or do you stop daily studies and only do test studies? I, I would rarely get time to both uh, do both, but uh, predominantly for uh, daily studying. So don't neglect your daily studies. That's your big advice. Yeah. Yes. If you neglect it, then a backlog will come, then panic will come before the test. Yes. Do both regularly and you can manage it comfortably if you study four to five hours. Yes. Yeah. That's your message. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Uh, Arithvik's parents are they here? I request if it's father to kindly join us. Congratulations, sir. Proud moment. Please come.
So, Ritwik, where are you joining? What is the college you're looking at? Yeah, EC at uh, Nagishwar. EC at Nagishwar at Kal, all set and sorted, ready for it. Uh, any words you want to say? Also, a thank to Sridhar, sir. Uh, because without you, Diksha is not there. Okay, <laughs> thank and you. thanks to Nitu, ma'am, and uh, Radha Krishna, sir. Okay, sir. Yes, Both sir. are motivated. Usually, they'll call it after 9.30 only. So, Ritwik, tomorrow's exam, whether you prepared or not, usually they'll give. Continuous follow-up. Continuous follow-up. Follow Those guys. Diksha Elanka is the best, I think, in my side. <laughs> Wonderful. But thanks to you, sir. Thanks, Very sir. happy to hear that, sir. A small bouquet. There you go, Ritwik. Congratulations. And may you have many more such occasions to Thank celebrate you, with medals. All the very best. And Please sweet in the moment, yes? Oh, be happy to. <laughs> there you go. You should also, as a parent, also please do one. <laughs> Wonderful. We'll take one picture. Wonderful. Excellent. Thank you. All the very best. Please be seated. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. I think with that, we've come to the end of this felicitation. I wish the children all the very best. Um, all excited, all ready, all set to go. Uh, start their new journey in the professional courses and go rule the world. All the very best, uh, children. God bless you all. Make us all proud. Thank you so much. Thank you, parents.